When I was a kid, I used to love going to parks. And my grandfather used to take me every Sunday. But my ex hated parks. He thought they were like too public or something. Sounds like a real dick. Well, my ex. Your grandfather. <laughs> so what happened between the two of you? <laughs> well, I graduated from school and I moved to New York and he uh, took a job in Chicago. It was sort of like a, a focus on your work life first sort of thing. They call us the selfish generation. What about you? Who's the one that gotcha? How dare you assume that I have any emotional capacity whatsoever? Get out of my park. No. Get out. No. It's okay. <laughs> you can come back. I was gonna hold out and I was gonna make you wait like 40 days or something. I was gonna make you wait too. Then I realized I'm a dude. <laughs> hey guys, it's Fred. Jesus, Fred, you're like reverse Elvis, you know? Fred, you enter the building. I love Elvis. Thank you very much. What's up, Fred? Well, Ellie from Simon just sent over the Matterhorn book cover. And she wants us to do it? Specifically. Specifically? Specifically. Woo! I'll get in on that. Right. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Fred. Yeah. All right. Gonna do it. Wait, okay, so let me get this straight. You have sex with this girl, we get a job out of it? Certainly seems that way. And to think this whole time, we thought that poor girl was a hooker. Well, yeah. But in reality, the only prostitute here is you. <laughs> no one came again. Again? Why don't you get better authors? Oh, you know, I never even thought of that. Yes, I've tried that. I've been trying. We'll come by my place after for a drink. I'll come back. 